then you're not going to be so focused on the one girl, the one approach you did, the one number you got that didn't work out. Because if you're constantly in new sets, talking to new women, you're going to be getting more leads. We've all heard the classic ABC line from a famous sales movie, Glenn, Glar Glenn Gary, Glenn Ross, when Alec Baldwin came in and was like, da, 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 gave a speech about sales. Great movie if you haven't seen it, but a key premise for sales is always be closing. And we can apply this to game because game is off basically sales, right? The product is yourself. Always be trying to get the, get the number right. And, and one of the beginner mistakes we see with a lot of students is they'll approach the girl and then They'll do all the conversation and then just not ask for the number. And they come out and I'm like, bro, why didn't you ask for the number? And she, they'd, they'd be like, oh, well, you know, I didn't feel the vibe. I'm like, man, she stood talking to you for 10 minutes. Her actions speak louder than words. She was keen. Um, but the spin on this is AB, ABO, always be opening. One of the biggest killers in, in this. So this is a skill set, a bit like sales, right? or any skill set. This is a skill set issue and a, a numbers issue. Yeah. Most guys will go out and like, some guys will do like three amazing conversations, right? But it's three in a week, it's not enough. They're not playing the numbers game part of, of seduction. And some guys go out on the spam approach and they have, there's no technique and it's, so it's literally hello, compliment, get number. And they just won't improve because they don't know how to flirt and banter and actually have a conversation and connect with a woman. So we've got issues for different reasons, but I'd say more often the issue is the numbers element. Guys just aren't approaching enough. The actual number of approaches you should be doing a week really is around 50. 50 women you don't know you should be approaching. That number scares the shit out of guys. And most guys don't have time to charge around the streets all day. Hence why we lowered the stat to 30. Because I'm a firm believer in actually if you do 30 approaches, that should generate you around two to three dates a week. But that being said, if you want to be on the safe side in terms of just exposure to the skill set of getting better at talking to women and flirting and having fun, 50. And access to more numbers because a lot of girls just aren't going to be, you know, available. They've got a boyfriend, they're in a rush. You look like, you know, their ex-boyfriend, they've got a husband, their dog just died, it's whatever. They're just not going to want to have the conversation, right? We play a game of inherent losses. It's about embracing uh, rejection and filtering through a lot of duds slaying a few dragons to reach the princess they say so yeah not a, not only is abc very important as a concept but the spin on that abo always be opening so 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 important it is a large degree a numbers game isn't it and i think a lot of guys they're just they're not bad socially they're not amazing but the issue they've got is not they've got this one issue with push pull or you know this 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 body language is slightly off it's they just don't speak to enough women 100% agree. Like you mentioned, you can have two really amazing conversations, but then, you know, they just flake off. In contrast, you know, you can have 30, some of them are going to be subpar, some of them are just going to be straight blowouts, but some of them actually, the girls are going to be interested. The difference is you're just putting in more reps. So I agree, 30 to 50. Again, it might seem a lot, but if you incorporate it in terms of your everyday lifestyle, and then maybe go out on a night session, get 10 to 15 out of the way, hitting 30 to 50 in a city of at least 1 million people it's perfectly doable so again um it's not all it's not gonna it's not the only way to solve all your problems but one of the main re ways to solve most of guys dating problems is just approaching more women and be you know having more conversations and that's when you're going to find those few that are going to come out and then you're not going to be so focused on the one girl the one approach you did the one number you got that didn't work out because if you're constantly in new sets talking to new women you're going to be getting more leads and then naturally you're not even going to overthink the ones who flaked off and then another big thing you're going to come off as less needy you're not going to be double texting you're not going to care if a girl didn't text you back or flaked on you neediness is a killer and it all stems down to our lack of approaching because if we just socialize and approach and constantly we're in conversations with different people we don't give a fuck and we're feeling good because we're present we're alive yeah. when you're truly present in life which you have to be when you're interacting with another human being really there's no stress because you're not worrying about the future or 
worrying about the past you're, you're in the moment and that's you know one of the best things about just being social and approaching is you're constantly in the moment you're in a flow state you're having fun and that's where the magic happens you know we're going to go out tonight it's a saturday night with with a couple of students and we're going to charge around the streets and go wild with the approaching and even if nothing comes of it in terms of dragging a girl home um you have fun you have a good time you feel alive right that's what we're built to be sociable as human beings so get out there it's saturday night go and speak to more human beings and we'll see you in the next video